everyone and we're here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if Windows 11 is not using all the available RAM. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to run the Windows Memory Diagnostic tool. To do this press the Windows button and simply type Memory Diagnostic and afterwards select it as Windows Memory Diagnostic from the search results. In here what you have to do is simply click on the restart now and check for problems option. What will happen next is that Windows will restart and check for any potential issues and fix them as soon as possible. Another useful solution is to check the page file. To do this press the Windows button then simply type View Advanced System Settings and then select it from the search results. In the System Properties window make sure to click on the Settings button under the Performance section and afterwards make sure to click on the Advanced tab. Now in here under the Virtual Memory section make sure to click on the Change button and make sure to untick the box next to automatically manage paging file sizes for all drives. Now simply select the problematic drive and make sure to select the no paging file option. Lastly, just click on the set button to establish the option that you selected for this drive and afterwards make sure to repeat the same procedure for all the drives. Then you can press on OK to save the changes and then restart your PC to check if the problem still persists. You can also modify the usable RAM. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type msconfig and select System Configuration from the search results. Now in here, just select the Boot tab and afterwards click on the Advanced Options button. The last thing you have to do is simply tick the checkbox for maximum memory, then enter the installed RAM on your system in the text field underneath and then click on OK at the button. Lastly, just click again on OK to save the changes and then restart your PC. Then you can check if the issue is solved. And lastly, another great solution is to modify the registry. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type RegEdit and select Registry Editor from the search results. Now in here, what you have to do is navigate to the following location. H key Local Machine, then double-click on System, afterwards double-click on Current Control Set, then Expand Control. The next thing you have to do is simply scroll down until you find the Session Manager key, then double-click it. And lastly, click on Memory Management. In here, just locate the clear page file at shutdown value and double click on it. Now, the last thing you have to do in the value data box is to change from 0 to 1. Finish by pressing on OK and then simply close the registry editor and restart your PC. You can then check if the issue still persists. And that's it. Plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.